Harbor Freight sells this automatic center punch. Um, Pittsburgh brand, it's their own house brand. These normally are $4. Uh, caught them on sale for $2 and bought two of them. So I thought I'd do a quick review. Let's see how they work. This is my drill press table and it's cast iron. I want to see if it'll punch a hole in cast iron. Here's the unboxed center punch. Try to see if it'll give me a divot in this cast iron. Okay, well, it's not doing what it's supposed to do. I'm pushing with it, but it's not kicking, giving me the release. That's very odd. There, I got it. And that did give me a, a little bit of a divot in the cast iron. So what I found is that if you just push down slowly, it doesn't work. You have to go fairly quickly and use a lot of force. I think if there was something on the back of this to put in the palm of your hand, it would work a little better for your hand. You can see I've got now a gouge in my hand. So I'm not sure. But it does work. It leaves a nice divot in the cast iron. So I'm convinced it would work good about everywhere. So if you look at the paper, chrome, validium, steel tip, polished brass handle with knurled grip, double spring loaded barrel, push to strike action. So item 621. Apparently it is, if it's a low item like that, it's been around for a while. So I thought I'd show you the construction. It's reverse threaded to take the barrel apart, which is kind of odd. You don't see that very often. And there's the action. And if you look down in there, there's the steel tip. So theoretically, the steel tip could be replaceable. Could. I'm not saying you would, but it could. So put it back together. So it reverse threads, that's kind of odd, but I'm sure there's a reason for that. So it's actually very handy. I wanted to use on steel, but I also wanted to use it on wood. I probably wouldn't use the spring action on wood. I'd use it more like an awl, just to push into the wood manually without the strike. The strike would probably penetrate the wood more than you wanted it to. If it creates a divot in this cast iron, it's probably going to destroy the wood, go too deep. So I'm actually looking forward to using this. Uh, very nice construction. Uh, knurled handle so it'll slide less in your hands. Nice tip. Uh, since I got these for two dollars I got two of them. So I expect to have these for quite a long time. At two dollars it's a great deal. Even if you use it for a while then get rid of it. Not an issue. Okay so if you like the videos please subscribe. Thanks for watching.